Hey everyone, here's my quail set up here. I have them in a hutch. And it's about eight feet by like one and a half feet deep. And uh, you can see here I have these little feeders. I got this feeder idea from Slightly Redneck. Um, he's got a YouTube channel. It's excellent. It really reduces the feed waste. Um, I have a platform for them to sit on. They want to sit. And here's their dust boxes. I got two long totes in here. This used to be a rabbit hutch. That's why this is still here. I should just take that off and not have it on there. But here's where my girls uh, lay most of their eggs. Um, and they do their little dust bathing. And they're pretty good at actually keeping it clean. And I like this too, this setup, because, oh, look, we even got an egg in there. I like this setup too because uh, they really get to uh, do what's natural. Um, it's natural to them and it keeps them, I think, calmer and it make, made them a lot happier. Highly recommend that you give your quail um, dust boxes. I have sand in here. We had leftover sand from an old, um, we used to have a um, an old fish tank that had um, coral in it and stuff in it. So this was really good sand to put in here. I had a lot of like, um, I don't know what you call it, like microbial type things that are really healthy. So they got to chomp on a bunch of that. You'll see seashells and all kinds of stuff in there. And they just pick at this all the time. They bathe themselves with this. They're super happy. Um, that's one of my roos right there. That's a lady. Yeah, so I just wanted to show you guys my little quail setup. It's not great. We're eventually going to replace this hutch because I'm not happy with this hutch. This is a hutch I got with my first um, rabbit breeding trio. So um, it's not the greatest, but it, it was due. It, it was good for for a start. And you just got to start somewhere, right? And you learn as you go. So here's my little, little, little quail egg. They're so cute, so small, and the dogs love them. Well, not all my dogs. My one dog over there, she's not a fan of quail eggs, <laughs> but my other dogs are. And so, yeah, that's my quail setup. It's not great. I'm eventually going to change things, especially when we move. That's probably when we're going to change things up. But yeah, that's what we got going on now. I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any questions, post it down below. Please like this video if you enjoyed seeing my little birdies and please subscribe to follow along. Have a great one.